This is the best defense of Madden 23, and I'm honestly not even sure that it's even close. It comes to us out of the Baltimore Ravens defensive playbook, and we're going to be in the Dime 236 wheel. Now, the Dime 236 wheel is a defense that was really popular last year, and I actually think it's even better this year because of how the alignment is going to work um, to be able to send pressure. Now, we saw in the MCS a lot of zone being ran, actually about 50-50 man and zone breakdown uh, from what teams and what some of the best players in the world were doing defensively. And I think that you're going to see the game continue to trend toward more of a zone-based meta for a lot of different reasons. But really the ultimate reason is because of the disguise that this is going to allow us to create. And also the fact of the matter that a lot of people have short and elite or route tech or short out elite on everybody. They have route running abilities all over the field. So you really don't want to be in man a, a, a ton. You might want to run man as more of a mix in. You might want to adjust and man up certain players. But this is going to give us, um, this defense is going to be primarily ran on base line. Now, if you want to get my full Dime 236 defensive ebook or Dime 23 Will defensive ebook, um, it's in our Patreon. And we've got kind of a little bit of a mini ver version of it out launch and then we're going to continue to add to this defense as it continues to um you know just be worked out uh continuing to become a better defense over the course of the next couple days with just different adjustments we show in the ebook how to stop the run out of this formation we show in the ebook why this formation actually gets better pressure than one four six and dollar combined and also we show um how to use this formation from an adjustments perspective in simple ways that you can actually pick this up and play it against anybody and have a lot of success. But for this video, just want to show you one simple thing, and that is our base, uh, our, not our base defense necessarily, but just a way, reason why this blitz is so good. So the play is DB Fire 2 out of Dime 2 3 Will. And you saw that I set my coach settings to baseline. All we're going to do is press, and that's literally the setup. Um, and what you're going to see here is you can kind of, you know, again, depending on how you want to play, you can move down into the center. Really, your primary role here is you want to play the running back. So the way that I like to defend Bunch is we're going to go ahead and outside third, this left side guy. We're going to inside third, the safety on the left side. And you see how everything, nobody moves. What I like about base and line defenses is, is nobody's going to move out of this. And this is going to give us a significant advantage in terms of disguising our coverage. This is also going to give us a significant advantage because what you're going to see is the pressure is going to scream off of the edge at the quarterback. Now, the beauty of this formation in general is the fact that this formation doesn't require any adjustments. It's very simple to be ran. So you're going to see we're getting double edge pressure um, at the quarterback. And again, this is pretty consistent. Um, you're going to find out this alignment with this guy right here being off the line of scrimmage. You can actually move this guy in, and if you want to run the contain variation of this, um, you can actually go ahead and do that. And you'll see right here, here's the contain, and you get this double edge kind of glitchy pass offs that are going to occur. Now, this is also really good because you're only sitting five. You could, if you wanted to, if you wanted to make this actually a really good defense, you could do something like this where we're going to double flat the right side. So we're going to actually zone that guy out. And we're just going to send, we're just literally going to send this five man variation. And that time they did block the running back, but you see that he's going to shed him quickly and be able to get in there. If the running back goes out on a route, uh, which we'll show you here, the, the an example of the running back actually going out on a pass route, you'll see here again, I'm standing right here. I see the running back go, I'm going to go user him. And you see how consistent this four man pressure is going to be for you. This formation also gets really, really good sheds. Again, I can't say it too much more in the YouTube variation of this content, but make sure you get the ebook because we're going to explain why this alignment is so powerful um, against the current meta and what you can do with this formation from an alignment perspective that makes it almost impossible for them to pick up the pressure. Thank you for watching this little preview video. If you want to get my Dime 236 Well Defensive ebook, make sure that you join our Patreon. I'm going to put a link to that in the description of the video down below it's only ten dollars to become a member and it'll get you access to all of my ebooks all the updates to those ebooks and any new ebooks that we release like i said this is our newest defensive ebook so if you want to check everything out become a patreon member it's only ten dollars to sign up for that and if you want to sign up head down to the description of this video and click the link down below